What is up ladies and gentlemen, CJ the Cheese DJ here and we are back with another Arc Genesis reveal for you guys today and what you are looking at right now is Moda. Now Moda is a gigantic underwater eel and it is going to be one of the sub bosses for the new Genesis map. Now by sub boss I mean it could potentially be like the lava elemental, like the ice worm queen, except she is a gigantic underwater eel. So guys, this is going to be giving us our first underwater boss, and I am so keen to test her out and go up against her. She looks absolutely terrifying, and you can see the length of her just there. Like, she looks like she's just huge. Like, she's definitely on par with, like, a Titanosaur, I would say, because she is absolutely gigantic. As well as that, she does have the power to call in uh, smaller eel-like minions. You can see these guys swimming around here, and uh, she is very bioluminescent, so I'm going to say that it's going to be a very... Uh, Fantastic looking fight in terms of colors and lights and stuff like that. But look at her mouth. It is terrifying. So guys, she's going to be one of the sub bosses as well as that. They also released um, biome specific dinosaurs. So you guys can see here that we've got a bunch of current dinosaurs, but with specific reskins. So you can see here we've got the volcanic Allosaurus, the snow biome Sabertooth, the bog Spino, the bog Paraceratherium, the bog Raptor. The Bog Parasaur, the Ocean Mosasaur, and the Bog Tappy. Look how sick these guys look. Now, the devs have said that these are pretty much just going to be a retexture. They're not really going to have any new abilities. However, they are still working on more dinosaurs, and this is just a small snippet of all the creatures and whatnot that they'll be working on. But guys, these look absolutely phenomenal, especially I'm a big fan of the Volcanic Aloe and the Bog Spino. And the, the Tappy, look at the Tappy, it looks absolutely dope. They pretty much wanted to include these guys to make sure that they kind of spruce up these new areas and they don't use the, the same sort of dinos that they have used for the past three expansions of Ark. And this will add a little bit of a freshness to the, to the world of Ark as well, I reckon. Because, yeah, you're going to be having these new looking dudes that look absolutely dope and you'll be seeing them everywhere. As well as that Modo coming in and as an underwater boss is going to be absolutely awesome. So it looks like they are also including the underwater section as a, an area because they do have the Mosasaur as a specific reskin. So I would say they are going to be including a couple more creatures into this sort of group. And I'm really keen to see what they do. At the moment, this is all concept art, but this concept art will pretty much, I'm going to guarantee that it will be in the game, which is pretty damn awesome. So guys, at least we see some of the new reskins. Now, bear in mind, we also have not seen the Lunar Biome reskins because there is a whole new Lunar Biome. I don't know if we'll see any of these guys up there. We definitely will be seeing those whales though. So keep an eye out for those. But yeah, I would guarantee that we would be getting a couple of reskins for the Lunar Biome as well. I just can't get over the bloody aloe. Look how sick he looks with the like magma course and throw him. So bear in mind, there's what, six dinos here? Seven. Seven? Eight. Eight dinos? Yeah, there's eight dinos here. There is over 120 dinosaurs in Ark, I believe. 120 creatures in Ark. So imagine how awesome some of these guys are going to be. But guys, that's going to wrap up the video for today. Let me know what you thought of it down below in the comments. Let me know whether or not you enjoyed it. But other than that, guys, thanks very much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one. And I got this soda,